Hi everybody, welcome back to Sunday School. This is our last lesson for the year uh, and it's about Queen Esther. But before we get started about Queen Esther, I just wanted to remind you there is still time. Send me in your video clip of you and your family singing your favorite Sunday School song or your parents' favorite camp song. I'll need it though by Wednesday, that's May 12th. So um, come back next week, even though there's not a lesson, I'll have a special message for you here on the Sunday School page. So I hope you are taking the time to do the things I sent for you in the mail. You can also send me pictures of that, any drawings or activities or coloring or crafts that you did. I really hope to see them. Uh, I've missed you all since we couldn't be together, but this was the next best thing and I'm glad you came online to watch. So on with the story of Queen Esther. She was a brave young girl and she was Jewish. Now, the Jews at that time were ruled by the people of Persia, and the king of Persia was a pretty hard man, but he did find himself a queen, and that was Esther. She had to keep it a secret, though, that she was Jewish because the Persians did not like the Jewish people. One of the king's helpers, whose name was Naaman, he really didn't like the Jewish people, and one of the Jewish people he didn't like just happened to be Esther's uncle. But Esther and her uncle together worked hard and they always followed God's commands. They worshiped God every day. Now, the king's advisor, Naaman, he didn't like that. And he set some things in motion to really hurt the Jews. Now, who was going to save the Jews? Who was going to save God's people? Who was brave enough to take care of God's people, even in that crazy time? Well, it was Queen Esther. She was just a young girl, but she found her voice and she became strong and she did what she knew God wanted her to do just like you can do. Even a young kid, you can take care of other people. That's what God wants you to do. You know what's best. Dig in your heart, follow God's command, and even though it's sometimes a little tricky or sometimes a little scary, be brave and stand up for God and God's people. So watch the video and listen to the song. And there's also, I saw online, a VeggieTales video about the girl who became queen. So if you have a half an hour and you would like to watch VeggieTales, the girl who became queen, Find it on YouTube. So until next week, have a great time.